Alright, hello and welcome to the Dusty Lampshade. I am one of the recorders. I am Justin. I record and <coughs> put my videos out on Thursday and Saturday. On Thursdays, uh, I will be putting out this game, which is Fire Emblem, The Sacred Stones. Number 8, it's for the Game Boy. Of course, I'm playing on emulator because I don't really have any other choice. And on Saturdays, I will be playing an array of online games such as Smite, maybe some League, and other arenas, shooter things. So, let's get started with number one, the first part of this game. Which we will start off. With this one. And new game. I'm gonna play it on normal, and then later on, I will probably go back through and play it on difficult, just because why not? So I'm probably either going to not read every everything. I'll read a lot of the dialogue, but I will try my best not to skip over anything that might be important to the game. I don't want anyone to get lost in the story and not know what's going on, but I know most of you don't care, but I tend to care a lot about the story of a game, or maybe some of the lore behind the game, it, well, to each their own. So I'll let it run through this so you guys can learn what the game is, this specific game is about and read, if you want. Alright, so now I have to come in and I have to hit the keybind for the A button every so often to kind of keep it rolling. Actually, I think I'll read this. For some 800 years, a quiet peace reigned the absence of a terrible darkness. The sacred stones have been passed from generation to generation. Nations have been built around their power and their legacy. The kingdom of Renaeus will thy Fado, the peerless warrior king. The kingdom of Frelia will thy Hayden, the fin somewhere sage king. The kingdom of Jehenna ruled by Isamir, Queen of the White Dunes. Assuming it's probably a desert area, probably. The Theocracy of Roast, ruled by Mansell, the Divine Emperor. Sounds like a religious area. I don't think they last long. And the Grado Empire, ruled by Vigar, the Stalwart Silent Emperor. These five countries house the power of the sacred stones. They are joined by the emerging mercantile republic of Carcinum. In these times of peace, tales of past conflict have drifted into legend, and memories of the ancient dark arts have all but evaporated. It is now the year. In an instant, the whole of Magna is threatened by an unexpected atrocity. atrocity. The Grado Empire, the largest of the Sacred Stone Nations, has invaded the Kingdom of Renaissance under orders from Emperor Vigard. A long-time ally of Grado, Renace is caught off guard, unable to mount any resistance. 
Grado's forces moved quickly, seizing one territory after another. Compounding King Fado's words, his son Prince Ephraim has gone missing. He is one of the main characters. He's the main guy. He also has a sister that we've learned. Grado's momentum carries his armies to the gates of Castle Peace itself. Reneus will fall. It is inevitable. No. Alright, so this is they have invaded the castle. And we are now going to meet our first main character and her experience dealing Dako ex escort. Your Majesty, I hear bad news. The castle gate has been breached. Emperor Vigardi's forces are within the castle walls. I understand. The garrison has fallen. We've lost contact with Prince Ephraim and can't expect no aid from this man. Your Majesty, what are we to do? What else can we do? Order your men to lay down their arms. Father! Eric, are you wearing the bracelet I gave you? Yes, I have it right here. Good. Seth. Yes, Your Majesty. Take Erica and head for Fred. King Hayden is an honorable man. I trust he will keep you safe. Understood. And what of Your Majesty? Me? I shall remain. We have long held battle among our dearest allies, yet now they attack. I must go on. Am I somehow responsible for have I earned, have I erred in my leadership? Reneus is not to God. How could I have failed him so? Father, you can't stay. You mustn't. If you remain behind, then so shall I. Go now, Seth. But did you ride? Take her to safety. Father. Forgive me. Da, 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 da. Druids, shamans, those are the great knights, paladins, general, sage, Ephraim, Eric, you must survive. Because they're the only heart hope for this kingdom. God forbid. Okay, so. General Seth. Franz, ride ahead and bring word of our coming to Freli. A, sig a single rider has better odds of passing unseen by Grandma's men. Convey to the throne all that has happened here and petition for reinforcements. Uh, understood. Princess Erica, we must. Quickly, behind me. Oh, God. You there, with the girl, tell me, would that be the wayward princess of Verneus? Well, this must be my lucky day. You're a dead man, the wench goes with me. Never! Battle scene, I am Falter, the Moonstone, Grotto's finest general. And you're just a corpse who does, does not know when he is dead. And battle. Oh, Seth misses. Waller hits 13 HP. That's it. Game over. Ah! No! Such terrible wound, and still he holds to his duty. How entertaining! Fly away, little man. Fly away. Try to outrun death. To save the hunt and of the kill. <coughs> okay. Princess Erica, this way I can see no more of Grotto's men. 
If we made it this far, we surely earn a moment's rest. Please forgive my grandma you so briskly hurry. Don't be foolish, Seth. If it weren't for you, I would never have made it to out of the castle. You are the reason I'm still alive. You have my gratitude. And whoever that man was, he was clearly after me. It's my fault that you received such a grave wound. Allow me to treat it, I... Your Highness, I can't allow an injury like this to be an obstacle. We have no important matter to attend to. We must press on to further. We must fulfill His Majesty's wishes. I wonder how my father fares alone in the castle. Do you think he's safe? And what of my brother on the crowd in front? We've heard nothing for him from him for days. King Fado and Prince Ephraim are both valiant and brave men. I doubt even the might of the Grado Empire would hold them in check. More important to me, Your Highness, is that you look to your own safety. How sad the two of them would be if something were to happen to you. We must reach Felon to ensure the day of your happy. Yes, of course, you're right. Until I'm reunited with my father and brother, I must not despair. I'll let you read the rest. No? Nope. Oh, 